Many people have wondered how they can capture and monitor the sensor data into a spreadsheet. In this short video, I'll show you how this can be done fairly easily using Balof's networking module. Start by connecting the sensors to the Balof module. They can be either IO link, discrete inputs, or even analogs such as 4 to 20, 0 to 10, or PT100. Balof's Profinet, Ethernet IP, and EtherCAT modules have built in web server. This web server can be accessed by going to an IP address. On this page, the module displays the cyclic and acyclic data of the connected devices along with the diagnostics information. By default, the web page is in HTML format. This can also be viewed in JavaScript notation. In case of Ethernet IP module, the process data of the connected devices will be shown on the web server regardless of the PLC being connected. Now let's take a look how to get the sensor data into Excel in 5 easy steps. Step 1. Open the web browser and enter the IP address of the Balof module. In this case, it's 192.168.0.1. By default, the web page is displayed in HTML format. So as a next step, change the extension from .htm to .jsn. The page will be then displayed in JavaScript notation, where it's easy to see the process data for the inputs, outputs, and the direct parameters, as well as some other information about the device that is connected. In this case, I'm using a Balof linear transducer, which will show me the level value in process data inputs. Next, open Excel and now capture the JavaScript data into a worksheet. This can be done by simply going to the data tab and then clicking on from web and entering the IP address that we just copied from the web browser. Once that is done, Excel will open Query Editor. It shows the same data in a structured way by putting that in rows and columns. So we just go ahead and pick the fields of our interest. In this case, we are looking at the process input data of Balof transducer. Then using some Excel magic, we make it look nicer and convert the hex values to decimal. And now we are almost done. Final step, and it is optional. Now we can refresh this data at a regular interval and capture that in a new worksheet for data logging. For that I'm using Visual Basic and a simple script which will refresh my data at every 5 seconds interval and capture that into the log every minute. As you can see, using just a few simple steps, I can monitor and record the data from my sensors and other devices into a spreadsheet. If you found these steps easy enough to follow, you can use the same steps and make the Balof module work with Microsoft's Power BI to analyze and monitor data in real time. You can call us at 1-300-225-833 to discuss your application and also organize a demo. Thanks for watching.